What's up, everybody? It's According to Seth's 31 Days of Halloween. We are on to day 17, and I got two films for you to check out tonight. Um, both of them are bloody, both of them are a blast, and they're honestly quite scary. So, without further ado, let's talk about these two films. First up, we got The Descent. I absolutely love this movie. It's one of my favorite horror films out there. It is bloody. It is absolutely terrifying, but it is a blast and 100% worth a watch. Essentially, what it's about is you have six friends who go, like, cave diving, splunking. They basically just go to explore cave is what I'm trying to say. And, well, they get stuck down there, and they're not alone. And what ensues is just absolutely terrifying and gory as all hell. Um, there's a scene in this movie where all they have is this, like, video camera that's, like, trying to show night vision. And what pops up behind them is utterly terrifying and gave me a nightmare for a week. Like, this movie is claustrophobic, and, you know, people are already afraid of the dark, but you put in claustrophobia, tight spaces, it amplifies that, and it just makes this movie ten times scarier. What they were able to do is nothing short of amazing with this film. Um, the cast is all fantastic, and it's 100% worth a watch. It's also on Amazon Prime, so just like this next movie, why not watch it? The puzzle that started it all, if you haven't seen Saw 1, you need to, because whatever happened after this one, it just got like a bloody mess, and or it became a bloody mess, and then it was less like, how can we kill somebody in the worst way possible, even worse than the previous movie, and it just got all over the place. But the first one is incredible. It reminded me a lot like the movie 7, where it kind of follows these detectives who are stumbling upon these like horrible crimes where you find out that this person named Jigsaw is um basically testing these people's will to survive and putting them up in these like horrible traps and then you also have this other story throughout the film where you have these two people who are chained to the wall in this like creepy room with a dead body in the middle of the room and from there it just it gets wild the end reveal of this movie is next level and the tension throughout this is just so good i can't recommend this one enough and tobin bell's performance of jigsaw is just fantastic and all of it but this one specifically. Um, they're both on Amazon Prime. Check them out. If you haven't seen these, you got to go watch them. Come back. And then, as always, hit that follow button. But enjoy.